My anaconda don't want none unless you got buns, hun. From behind the scenes footage to exclusive interviews, we've scoured the depths of the internet to bring you 50 Nicki Minaj videos we bet you've never seen before. Anaconda don't, my anaconda don't want none unless you got buns, hun. You have probably seen Nikki featured in the barber shop, but you'd never guess that she acted in a movie when she was 18 years old, where she played the role of an angry phone girl. We gotta be careful. <laughs> did I hit you with the phone? No. Yeah, it, it looked like it. She did. These throwback pictures of Nikki before fame are ones that never went viral as they were taken before she became famous. Pictures like these serve as a reminder that the gorgeous rapper has come a long way in her career. Three. Nikki has a sense of humor, but it has always been there. This is an interview where Jabari asks the rapper about her journey to getting signed by Lil Wayne, and she gave the most hilarious answer. Lil Wayne is running the game right now. One of the best MCs by numerous people. Okay. And you know, He's the president, yes. The president. And you know, you're, you're his first lady. How did that happen? I'm his mistress. Mistress? I'm Nikki Lewinsky, mistress. Oh. Okay. Nikki has always said she's the baddest in the game. But a throwback video of Lil Kim's song, Jump Off 07, Prove this title as she spit bars and did justice to the song. Jump on 2007, yeah. Miss Nikki, let's get it poppin', baby. Queen, Queens, Queens, yeah. Hey, y'all, Fendi, this the jump off right here, and then Angelo, mama, get a taste of the hot. Another video of the old days, which showed Nikki on a freestyle to a song, Dirty Money. This song was an easy flow for her. The music I'm gonna run it like Chris Brown. She won three rounds, I'ma need a hundred thou. Like Chinatown, bitches better bow down. Oh, you ain't no betcha, bitches know now. The music video, if Nicki rapping the song The Come Up DVD, volume 16, back in 2007. Niggas that leave on Monday, come back. Jabari interviews Nicki yet again where she talks about her hard work and how far she has come from way back 2008. Oh, since the last time we talked, how has your progress been? My progress has been great. I'm working on a great album. It's very entertaining. Very a random video showing Nikki just doing what she knows how to do best, killing the freestyle. Peter pay ya to these bad bitches. I'm mother maya. I wanna know why you waste your time yank. on these rap hoes that don't write they rhyme. Yank. Nikki talks about her family, where she came from. I came from a broken home. Well, and how hard she goes for her passion in music. Here's Nikki clearing the air and shutting down haters by letting all of them know she writes her rhymes, so nobody should ask her if she writes her songs. Why I gotta keep on saying I write my own rhymes? Like, don't ask me why I do that. I do that because there's not a day that goes by that some clown don't come up to me and be like, "Yo, you write away your lyrics, ma." A rare clip of Nikki with Da Boys on Instagram Live, having fun with fans while reading out funny comments. Oh, because so now one time I was on you, I was on TikTok and I saw the thing. An interview clip of Nikki on the XSL show where she discussed her journey moving forward while reminding everyone that she's the new baddest chick. Vision at my money that I don't hear these little barking, you know, itty bitty piggies, you know, around me talking crap. I just like, I'm focused on my money and I'm getting it. An old video of Nikki's rap song, Itty Bitty Piggy, on an IG live with Lil Wayne. The female rapper rants to Wayne about how haters are all up in her business. Nikki goes ahead to talk to her fans on TikTok. During an Instagram live, a fan asked Nikki for the color of her parties, which left the rapper in shock. Nikki's fans seem to joke around her a lot, as another fan tells her that she looks like the lesbian version of RuPaul. This is a clip where Nikki looks high as a kite while she went live on Instagram. 
Nikki performed with the crowd at the Trinidad and Tobago Carnival, where they were screaming at the top of their lungs to her song. This is one viral clip where her ex-boyfriend Meek Mill was abusing her verbally at an event where she was maintaining all smiles. Jimmy Fallon asked Nikki during The Tonight Show to do a freestyle rap using random words she's never seen before. Oh my God. What? These are, it's hexagon, Yeti. Yeti could be, you know, either the, you know, it's like Bigfoot or it's also a cooler. Nikki was seen screaming at a dinosaur that allegedly photobombed her selfie. The clip shows Nikki having fun with one of her die-hard fans, where they rap together on her You Already Know verse. Nikki's fans came out in their numbers to greet her after she announced the launch of her own record label on Queen Radio. The rapper looked obviously tired, but still engaged her fans in a conversation. We go home. Because I just wanted you to see it. A rare clip of Drake and Nikki going shopping together while having the best moments at the store. Get anything I want? Get whatever you want. Get whatever I want? Get whatever you want. Oh, all right. Nikki puts one of her fans to test as he asked for an autograph, and she asks him to describe what her first mixtape looks like, and he couldn't answer. A young fan of Nikki took to stage during one of her performances and took the spotlight by twerking on the rapper and making nice moves and poses, leaving the rapper in awe. Drake falls in love with Nikki's filter on Snapchat, saying he felt pretty. Doja Cat calls Nikki to give her details on her new look, after she shaved her hair and Nikki supports and encourages her. Nikki goes live on Instagram during her kick tour in Oakland. She was singing the lyrics of one of the songs off the album. Nikki goes live with Sexy Red where they both have fun and discuss accents. James and Nikki go on a car cruise through the streets of Los Angeles, singing some of her biggest hits. James gets to ask Nikki about her balance with her career and being a mom. Video showed a pissed Nikki debunking the rumors that she sniffs coke in her Instagram live. Nikki shoots a commercial for Easter Sunday, but laughs all the way on set without saying her lines properly. Nikki sings in the studio while drunk about pussy and panda, with her real voice and no auto-tune, leaving fans amazed by how great her voice is. Oh, the Mimar's game is cold. Kill everybody walking. In American Idol season 12, where the rapper was one of the judges, she spoke negatively about her homeland, Trinidad. It was a Nikki and Mariah moment, where they ended up teasing each other on the American Idol season 12. Here's a mashup clip that proves that Nikki uses swear words too much. Back in her hometown, Trinidad, Nikki gives a resounding motivational speech to the crowd. Always better days ahead. You know, I want you guys to be encouraged. I want you guys to know that God didn't promise us a, a problem-free life. We ain't never gonna have that. You know? The rapper visited the saloon she usually made her nails back in her hometown, where she reminisced on old times as school children came around to see her. A video of Nikki chewing ice on Instagram Live like it was chips. Nikki at the behind the scenes of Gucci Mane's song, Make Love. The clip shows Nikki at the behind the scenes of her song, Right Through Me. Nikki gives an unfiltered look at the enigmatic pop star as she prepares to launch her album. Nikki Minaj, having fun doing a photo shoot for a cove shot by Marie Claire. Nikki talks about her song, Roman's Revenge, the process of recording and the story behind the song. The clip shows Nikki having a shoot at the behind the scenes of the song, Dip by Tyga. Nikki and Zoo having a loved up moment at the jacuzzi. Leave your thoughts on the subject in the comments section. 
Also, like, share, and subscribe to the channel for more. We'll see you next time. Bye, E. Thank you.